Ladies and gentlemen, it's the host here. It is Team I right now. How are you doing on this Thursday's edition? I am doing pretty well. Anyway, my viewers, I have social media accounts, but don't worry, I'll discuss that later on in this video. Now, I want you guys and gals to sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to eat, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Now, in this video, It'll be just an article. Alrighty then. Now probably a lot of you are aware about this information. Okay, I'm going to try my best to read it from my trusty laptop. The reprogramming rights for Raw NXT SmackDown are set to expire next year. Raw currently has... Arranged with USA Network. I I don't know if I said that word correctly. Probably not. I do apologize. Network include USA Network, Warner Brothers, TBS, or TNT, Discovery, and FX are rumored to be interesting in getting the broadcasting rights for Raw. Wow. Can you imagine you click on... A certain day and is on, on a different channel because it was always on USA Network except that one time it was on Spike TV then they decided to go back to USA Network okay now this is just rumors okay now there's another possibility that when at Raw might go to a different day I don't think that will ever happen I think the only reason they want to do that because they want to have their own viewership, okay? They don't have to butt heads with Monday football, you know? Hey, Wes, that's W's fault of not pushing the envelope after all these major superstars left the company, you know, retired and do other things. That's their fault of not fixing Raw, and that's why Noe does not give a fine crap about my net raw. I mean, it's okay, but it's not like the good old days, you know. We all know that. Everyone knows that by now. Also, listen to this. Most of the talk is that raw is going to FX. Sorry, FX. According to Dave Milzer on Wrestling Observer Radio, don't believe. What do you have to say? Because this guy is full of baloney. You know? I don't believe it until it's official from the W itself. I remember when W decided to leave USA Network and go to Spike TV at the time. I think it ran for a few years. Then they decided to go back in 05. Remember that? Raw Homecoming, they made a big thing about it. And then probably some of you, or a lot of you, still have that DB. I guess it's worth a lot of money to this day. So, what's your thoughts? What would be a perfect fit for Monday Night Raw? I don't think they're going to renew their contract with USA Network. I think that's out of, the, out of the, um, the books. So, all these other networks could have scooped them up. And I cannot imagine TNT will get the rights for Raw because they own the rights of AEW, don't they? So that'd be very unique. Have two different wrestling promotions on your channel. Wow. I, I mean, on your broadcasting. So whenever it's official, I will discuss this the best I can. Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. Now, if you want to be a part of the Robert Show, that's fine. And Danny, if not, don't worry about it. See you guys tonight. Peace out.